Today I'm going to talk to you about how to read an audiogram. This is the first video in a three part series. I'm going to explain the different scales on the audiogram and what the marks mean when we look at a hearing test. The value that I hope you get from this is an understanding of what your results mean. Part of the hearing test process is we record your responses from the test along this graph. This is called an audiogram. Along the top you can see some numbers going from smaller to larger numbers. This refers to the frequency of the sound that you hear. So these are low pitch beeps all the way across to high pitch whistles. Down the side tells us how loud the sound needs to be in decibels before you can hear it. As the test progresses, we record your responses for each frequency along the graph. The circles are for the right ear, the crosses are for the left ear. We also record some brackets, which is another part of the hearing test. On this hearing test, you can see the marks are all within the shaded region. We would say this person's hearing is within the normal range. On this hearing test, we can see the responses start off within the normal range at the low frequencies but as we go to progressively higher frequencies the hearing starts to drop away. On this hearing test we would say the person has a high frequency hearing loss. If you have a high frequency hearing loss where you can't hear in this region you will find it a lot harder to hear people talking when there's background noise or you'll start to miss the high pitched parts of speech. On this hearing test we can see the marks are all down below the normal level from the low frequency all the way across to the high frequency. So for a hearing loss like this the person would have trouble hearing almost all sounds. In fact everything would sound quite soft. I hope that today's video has given you a greater understanding of what the results from a pure tone audiometry test mean. If you suspect that you might have a hearing loss, please make an appointment to come in and we'll perform a hearing test and show you the graph of your hearing. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up, leave a comment or subscribe to our video channel.